It's a little controversial, yeah. We do have people that occasionally like you're doing what? So look at this. These are all new labels. These are on the books at a local library. And as you can see, if you pick up these books, there are no more Dewey Decimal numbers. Our Rich and I went to the Greenwood Public Library today to learn why those bookshelves are getting rearranged and how it may help you find the book that you're looking for. Unless you know sports are at 796 in the Dewey Decimal System and cookbooks are 641 point something, you might get lost in the nonfiction section of your local library. People don't come in and go, I feel like an 811 today. No, they think I want poetry. The Greenwood Public Library is ditching Dewey for a shelf system they call subject savvy. People will be able to browse more easily because when they come, they'll find all the books on one subject in one place, which with Dewey wasn't necessarily true. Some 35,000 nonfiction books are being reorganized and relabeled by subjects and subcategories. The process is just getting started and will likely take most of this year. If you're looking for a book about horses, you just come to the animals section, then farm animals and a subtopic of horses. You don't have to know anymore that the Encyclopedia of the Horse would be found at 636.1. They've always been able to ask us, they've always been able to look in the catalog system, but this speaks their language instead of the library language of Dewey, so we're really hoping that as they come in they become more confident library users and find what they need. We also like that it fits the way people think, so we say subject savvy thinks the way you do. Nonfiction books are assigned to one of 31 subjects, labeled with sub categories and stacked alphabetically. Animals is the first subject. Arts and crafts books will soon fill the empty shelves to the right. We are doing everything we can to make our library part of their current life and part of their future. And as a result of changes like this, we're seeing book circulation increase. No more looking up numbers. Just read the words, then read the book. I'm Rich Knight, Channel 13 Eyewitness News. Now, libraries have used that Dewey Decimal System for over 140 years to classify nonfiction books. Yeah, to make this change, there was a little bit of investigation that went on. The Greenwood librarians went to other libraries in Indiana, for example, the one in Kendallville up in Noble County, and also a library in Wells County that have reorganized before, and they're using this subject-savvy mm. system, too.